Hello little friends, I am Lewis. Welcome to Learnsable. Today we will explore about light and shadow. Light is a form of energy. We need light to see things. The sun is our main source of light during the day. We are able to see an object when light from an object enters to our eyes. This happens when the object is a source of light. The object reflects light from a source of light. The box can be seen because it reflects the lights from the torch into our eyes. Different materials allow different amounts of light to pass through them. For example, glass, water, air allow most light to pass through them, that's why we can see through them clearly. Wood and metal do not allow light to pass through them, and we cannot see through them. Take a pipe and put a candle on the opposite side. Now try to see the candle through the pipe. Yes, you can see the candle. Now, let's bend the pipe in the middle. Let's try to see the candle again. Can you see it now? No, you cannot. Because, light travels in straight lines only. And when light is blocked by an object, shadows are formed. And the shape of the shadow is similar to the shape of the object. An object can have shadows of different shapes depending on which part of the object the light is shining at. In case, a shadow will be in square rectangle, and in case B shadow will be in oval shape. That's very interesting, isn't it? The size of an object's shadow depends on the positions of the object, the light source, and the screen. Here, box is placed closer to the light source, or we can say further from the screen, and we can see shadow is bigger. Now, let's move the box closer to the screen or further away from the light source. Now shadow is smaller. So, what we learned from it? When the object is nearer, the light source or further from the screen, the shadow is bigger. When the object is further away from the light source or nearer the screen, the shadow is smaller. So, what we have learned today? An object can be seen when it reflects light or when it is a source of light. A shadow is formed when light is completely or partially blocked by an object. The size of an object's shadow depends on the positions of the object, the light source, and the screen. That's all for today. Have fun! See you in our next class.